Hello everybody and good day to you all today. I'm talking about Star Go season number two, episode number eight, number ten. Summer School Chapter 10, the episode directed by um Celine Chosky Chosy? Chosy? Mm, sorry. And this is the episode here. Okay, now we got we got Pat and we got Courtney going out there to try to find um Jennifer. They're trying to find her because she because because um the staff that Courtney is using right now, the Star Go staff, is not is not fully powerful enough to be much Excuse me, bring the jewels back together. You, know, you got Shay coming down from his dimension. He's dying. And he said, hey, the only way we can, be much, uh, can stop the eclipse, so we got to bring his jewels back together. And when the jewels come back together, we're going to put them inside of it. And then uh, we can bury this beast in, into, into nothingness and never be seen forever again. And we win. And we says, yeah, I'm down with that. And people say, I don't know. I don't know if you can trust him or not. And we said, no, I think he's telling the truth. I mean, he's done it so far. And they said, okay, let's do this. And so, you got Courtney trying to put the thing back together. She couldn't do it. Oh, well. But, but, but you got Pat saying, hey, I know somebody. Said, oh, we're going to be Nora too. And they, they, they go off together to pretty much find, to find Jennifer. We also get a flashback between um, 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 between, between Pat and the original Star Lord. Um, what's his name? Sylvester. And it was a nice moment. It was, it was a nice sweet moment. Did we did we need it in the story? I don't know. I don't think so. But it was nice to see that they actually did, they actually did come back together after, after what happened because they 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 they, 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 they killed a the man, and so. Pat was against it, but then he, he the whole team went out there that they well be messed up, which caused the team to pretty much like kind of fall apart because of, after that. But it was nice to see that nice little moment. It was nice. It was nice to see it. Nice to see that. It didn't help the story out or anything, but it was it was nice to see. And then we got the whole thing going on with where you got Mike and you got um finding out that that, that, that whole that whole um um gen, gen, genie situation is still out there, and he also found out who has it now. I just oh that's gonna be interesting. And we got Beth. Talking to her parents differently than she usually does. Usually she's trying to get her parents' attention or trying to be nice to them or butter up to them all the time because they don't want to pay, pay, pay no attention to her. And this time she's saying, you know what? I got some things I got to do now. Y'all never want to pay attention to me. And it, it, you, may, you may want to be a part of my life right now, but not, not, not right now, I can't do that. So until y'all get yourself together, right? You want to get divorced or not get divorced? You want to you fill me in on that situation? Then I'll tell you what's going on with me. Because right now they think she's crazy. And so th that's that. So overall, this episode was just okay. It's, a, it's, it's an interesting story now they start setting up with the whole thing going on with um with Jennifer and her, and her twin brother who's out there. Now, especially the whole thing going with that, with that nurse, that was kind of suspicious there. And then and then I also got, got, I also got the whole twist that happened with the shade, which I thought was very interesting. How you pretty much like played them to help, to help him out in his, his, his situation. That was kind of nice. And then you got the whole the, 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 whole, the whole genie situation going on there with Mike, with Mike, which uh, it might be kind of interesting. So right now the the team is pretty much broken apart. Courtney got beat up by, by, by Eclipse, though. She's stuck into another dimension. Rick is still in prison, is in jail right now. He ain't getting out anytime soon because he pretty much beat his uncle to have to death. But on the bright side, you got Simon McGrundy giving him apples, which was kind of, was kind of sweet. I just, oh, that was nice. He, he made a friend. And, and, but, but it's, it's, and then you have... So the only person you really had on the team who could really help out save the day is Beth? Oh, my gosh. Oh. Now, I don't know what's going on. Are they trying to make a new team? Are they, are they trying to place everybody? I, I mean, they had, they had to come back eventually. But the, but the thing is, though, they didn't really finish one storyline. So then, so they got the other, other storylines going on, too. So, like, how are they going to do the whole thing with the, with the twin brother thing with, with Jennifer? Is it going to be a separate thing or is it going to be all incorporated inside, inside of this situation? I don't know. Is, 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 um, is Jennifer finally her twin brother going to help them beat Eclipse out? Because in the comic books, Jennifer has like um, Green Lantern like powers, and her twin brother he, he kind of like the shade. He kind of like, like like shadow powers. Would, 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 if they find him, would he be able to team up with Shade to help them stop Eclipse out? Because it was her energy blast that was strong enough to, 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 to put the jewel back together again. So what? So is her brother like the, and them two? Are, are they the key to help them stop Eclipse out? Maybe. I don't know. Cause that, if that's the case, will they become part of the team? Will they replace Rick and um Yolanda? Because they're gone. And I don't know how they're gonna get Rick out of jail. Unless his father, unless his uncle says it was an accident, he's not pressing charges. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. So this episode was, was okay. The main storyline 
isn't that great. But the other, but the other thing that they're pretty much setting up for is very interesting. Because the problem, the main problem, the main storyline is the bad guy. Like you, st you establish him to be tough and like, this, this menacing threat that he, he can't be stopped. Shade tried to stop him. Pacquiao Pac almost got killed. Um, 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 I think her name is was Sydney. I can't think of her name. Is. I think it's Sydney. She tried to she tried to go up against them. She got sucked into another dimension where, where Courtney is now. So most likely they might, they might meet up. Maybe I don't know. Rick and uh, they're, not, they're, they're out of commission. So the only person who actually stood up to him was Beth. So that makes so it, like this, I don't know if the bag would be like a threat or is he weak? Like is it just an illusion that they give him his power? But at the same time, it was an illusion that, that stuck Beth into that I'm sorry, that stuck I'm um, Courtney into that, that other dimension. So how they're not, they're not consistent with him. If if I actually knew, if see if Beth didn't win, he was still like a threat to me. But since Beth won. He doesn't seem that much of a threat anymore now. But yeah, he beat the, yeah he beat Courtney so easily like this. I don't understand. Like this, they're not consistent with this. The, 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 the powerhouses who can't you know what? Yeah, the powerhouses who, who, who could not stand up against them. The most powerful, the, the as strong as physically was Iron Man, with, because he had that jewel thing. So he so he, so he pretty much broke him mentally. Elanda was a great, excellent fighter, strong that way. But he also mentally, Courtney, he just, he just threw her in another dimension. So I just, I don't know. But yet, Beth was the only one who actually was able to stand up against them and get a win. Which is like kind of confusing. Like, I, is he like, is he a threat or is he not a threat? Uh, but we'll see where this is going. We'll see where this is going to go. It might turn, it might turn, it might turn around, it might be fantastic or it could end with a huge huge fail I don't know this is this season so far has not, has not been the strongest yeah so we we'll see, we'll see, we'll see what this goes hopefully it ends on a on a higher note because right now things are not looking that great so we'll, 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 see, we'll, we'll see how, how things are going to turn around from this so leave comments down below let me know what you saw this episode of Star Girl. if you haven't watched it check it out for yourself hopefully you watching you will enjoy having watching it too so give it a chance like hit the thumbs up Bam. And subscribe to my channel and share. I really would appreciate it. Like I always say, in my dreams in life, I am the Ninja Rabbit. Uh, peace out, uh, people.